So usually differences are related to function. At that point, we define a polynomial that encapsulates the function at that point and the differences are included. The polynomial that has the approximation to that function. The basic idea that usually differences are related to function. At that point, we find the vector polynomial. And the reason that they want to learn the polynomial, the polynomial, they are there. So now, the reason for the differentiation, the reason that they want to share in this session, the reason for the differentiation is the process of computing the value of the derivative of an explicitly unknown function. The reason for the differentiation is the process of computing the value of the derivative of an explicitly unknown function. So it's given discrete set of points. X such as i point to this point where i is equal to zero to zero. If x such as i are discrete space, the main definition, the derivative, if there is discrete, if there is given set of points x such as i point such as i where i is equal to zero. If x such as i are this space, we can convert the expression formula in this to define the derivative divided between r such as r between r such as one. We can back out the expression formula if we need to complete the derivative divided in r such as one. Then in function. So in the unit differentiation, we discuss with the power of the formula and with the method of the formula. So first, what is with the power of the formula to derive the expression value? Then to solve some problem by using this method of the formula. Similarly, we did a discuss about with the method of the formula and derivation. Then for example. And finally, we give some examples of the power of our level of work. So, let us start with the level of work on the answer. Okay. Yes. So, now the level of work is the greatest power in the level of work. You are ready? So, I have made your angle calculator. Yes. In the level of work class, I will have not given your angle calculator. There is also a lot of examples. Okay. Rho u by y is equal to 1 by y. Okay. Can I understand? Are you able to follow? Okay. Now, in this case, what can we determine? We know that under the y is equal to the power of the power of the power. Similarly, here, v y by v is equal to rho y by rho u. Rho e by rho is equal to what? 1 by rho 1 by rho is equal to delta or not plus 2 into q1 and that's delta 2 that's what that and c is equal to minus q minus plus 2 by q that's the way and so on. At such a desired point of x is equal to x not u is equal to v not v rho. At the initial point. We consider x is equal to x naught, y is equal to v rho. So now this value is to this function. v y is equal to x. When x is equal to x naught, we call it 1 by x into delta y naught minus half del square y naught plus 1 by q del cube y naught minus 1 by 4 del power 4 y naught, etc. Similarly, the second value. Beta y by the way is not equal to rho u by rho x naught b y by the way into rho u by rho x. So, the second derivative of this function is that beta y by the way is not equal to 1 by x square delta y naught plus x. Okay? So, beta y by the way is square and x is equal to x naught is equal to Similarly, the third derivative, b 